our experience is always changing, that we can rely upon, it's always changing. And the open intelligence that is fundamental to all our experience, that is experiencing all the data, is completely reliable, constant, always present, always on. So in short moments, we simply relax as we are and let everything be as it is. Let the data arise as it is. Let our experience simply shine forth as it is. And see that we aren't separate from that flow of experience. It's not us looking in on open intelligence and the data. We are inseparably a part of it. We are part of this great flow of experience. And so in the Balance You training, the four mainstays that support us are the first mainstay is short moments of simply relaxing as we are, acknowledging open intelligence, letting the data stream, whatever it is, be as it is, and going from there, living from there, seeing for ourselves what happens. And I just see for myself that disposition of relaxing more with my experience has just brought about a reality of ease and potency, like two things that conventionally we might not think go together, like being at ease in our experience and being capable, empowered and potent at the same time in our life. Being able to respond in a way that I wasn't able to before. Being able to relate open-heartedly, no matter what's going down and a capacity to understand myself and others very naturally and instinctively. And the other mainstays of Balanced View are the training. It's a wealth of um, texts and teachings um, and media on the website where we hear the experiences of others and we come to trainings and it's a very direct support to empower this recognition for ourselves. And then there's a trainer, somebody who's gone before, who can support us, who can share their experience and say, yeah, I understand that. I know that experience and I was able to relax in the midst of it and all is well. And also, like was said in the talk, shines a bright light upon how incredible you are. Every single human being, a total powerhouse. And nothing more is needed right now than for people to know this no matter who they are, no matter where they're living, what their background is, that they are a great empowered being. That's what everyone needs to know. Because we've been living too long under this erroneous idea that there's something wrong with what we feel, there's something wrong. There's something wrong with feeling guilt. There's something wrong with feeling confused or feeling unbeneficial or anything, any data stream that may arise, any thought, any emotion, we simply give it the space to let it be as it is and see very directly for ourselves what's happening. We see that data streams, experience arises and resolves on its own, each moment clearing itself. And in seeing that, it brings greater relaxation. It's like, ah, oh, all those things I'm trying to get rid of, the bad feelings, the bad things, you know, things that I've spent my whole life like managing. Where is it? Where is it right now? Where is that thought? Where is that emotion? Where can we locate it? It's open, vast, wide, open intelligence. That's all it is. And so we just start to see that we have this great mastery over our own experience, over our own mind, no longer a victim to it no longer feeling overwhelmed by it in the way that we were, or for myself, how I felt so limited, limited by my own thoughts and emotions, like, I can't do that, or I'm not good enough, or I'm constantly doing something wrong, <laughs> or even in the presence of seeing, seeing in that situation of feeling like something, we've done something wrong or seeing that somebody else has that opinion of us, we just completely relax, completely relax and see that that, that data stream is inseparable from open intelligence. And I just see in my own experience in that as just a capacity to continue to be open, continue to relate openly with, with my own experience and with the other person. And uh, 
this intelligence that we are is completely beneficial, is completely responsive to time, place and circumstance. And when we just let it be as it is, it sh shines forth with this benefit, with beneficial responses and conduct. It's a bit like sort of like spending my whole life trying to make myself beneficial, like constantly like amending and editing and like striving to make myself a sort of perfect Lizzie. And then I'm just invited to just relax. And then this beauty of everything does just shine forth when we just relax as we are. And you just feel, feel the great benefit of your body even just sitting here resting as we are, the warm hum of you as you are, everything just, just shining forth in total perfection. With this as our starting point to be in life, everything opens up. So that doesn't mean that there aren't thing, issues and problems to be looked at in the world. That's exactly why Balanced View is here. It's a beneficial solution. It's a solution presented for humanity to take advantage of, for us all to take advantage of if we're open to it. To be able to experience our reality fully, look at things clearly, no longer shy away. Rest openly in the flow of all experience and be completely informed by that. And then see from there what is of most benefit. And that just becomes unavoidably the guiding principle, what is of most benefit. And just seeing in my own life how much I avoided of my own experience, not wanting to feel um, negative, not wanting to feel inferior, not wanting to feel disempowered, and letting myself feel all of those things, seeing that that data arises and resolves on it, its own. It's just profound wisdom, heart connection, capacity to understand and support others. And then to really, truly, for the first time, see how I want to live. What do I want to do? And giving myself the time to become acquainted with open intelligence. There's no rush. There's no rush at all. We're just exactly where we are, exactly how we are, is totally perfect. And taking the time just to get to know that, to relax the striving for things to be any other way, is so, so powerful and so precious. And then what I see in the Four Mainstays, so the fourth of the Four Mainstays is community. Like, ah! And, like, and that's, I mean, it comes alive. Like, it all comes alive in community with each other. I mean, human beings, we just love each other so much. I mean, it's like this like, continual love affair. Like, and, and I just do it in my life. I, that's all I ever did is really like love so much. But at times, I didn't think I could love that much. So I just muted it down, and it just got all confused. But actually, when we just relax, we just see it's head over heels in love with reality as it is. That's what it is. Our obsession with data streams, with the good, the bad, and the negative, we just love data. <laughs> love our experience so much. <laughs> so just to relax and let ourselves open up in that great love of reality is just the most incredible way to live. And then to come together with other people where we see that potency and ease very in direct action. Like, hang out in the Balanced View community, you can't not do things. <laughs> like Everybody's like, busy, let's, busy being a benefit, let's like, get together and do stuff and, <laughs> and like, make, thing, make things better for each other, for everybody. Let's train this up. Like, what is it when we relax, when we let ourselves be completely, when we rest in the great open heart of reality, what is that? And let's discover it together. We just see very direct, like when I'm, started spending time with the community, it became unavoidable that this empowerment took place because I was with people who saw me completely, who saw my true identity. Even if I was still emphasizing or you know, fixating on ideas about myself, all I got was like, wow, you're amazing. I was like, you know, for a while, it just took a little bit of time to get used to. I was like, oh, no, 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 you know, like running away, hiding behind us door somewhere <laughs> coming to a meeting not coming to a meeting because it's like oh, it's a bit much and um and, 
and then just we just sort of settle in, relaxing there, whatever's coming up, relaxing right there, and starting to see increasingly that yes, we are incredible. I am an incredible, exalted being, as are you, as is everybody. And in the four mainstays, unavoidably, that becomes obvious to us, and we settle into that power. And however it looks, no matter what is coming up for you, it is your opportunity to simply relax, to recognize open intelligence, and see for yourself from there. And that's the invitation from this open meeting, from any, uh, any uh, talk or any training, is simply to take it in your own experience, to, as any data stream arises, just to relax, recognize the openness of your intelligence, and see for yourself. And I saw very quickly for myself that there was immediate benefit present, immediate relief. That I didn't need to persist in the way I'd been using my mind. And then just to continue to, in my own pace, use the support of the four mainstays and grow in that confidence. And I can just say, like, I've never been able to say about anything in my life, but this works. It's like, shit, this works. Oh my God. Like, Everybody, this is really good. <laughs> like, just relax. It's brilliant. It's brilliant. And then, like, just, it's sort of beyond, you know, it takes just a while to, like, go, oh, my God, this is genius. And, and then to live it, to just live it. And that's the other thing. It's, like, not about running around, like, telling everybody. It's just living it as we are and the benefit that spills out from that in our relationships, in our everyday life. When we are at ease, other people feel that. It's so, it's so infectious and, and it's just such a precious gift to share that.